Okay, looks like we're all recording. We're all good. Welcome back, everybody. So we're gonna go ahead and continue this, but I gotta, like, mention something right quick. So we actually did attempt to uh, stream this again prior, but it turns out that we still can't even get past Lorelei. Like, I actually used the rare candies I had on me, right? I spent a while even training on some of the, the other trainers with the Versus Seeker. We still can barely even get past Lorelei's Dugong. Like, she's re re actually really tanky here. So let's let's go here. Hang on. So we need to go back and actually go ahead and train on more trainers. I was a little... I really didn't want to have to do that, but there's not really much of a choice, so we're going to have to. Because you can't rematch anyone in Victory Road, the wild Pokemon there are too weak, and half my team can't even, like, KO any of Lorelai's Pokemon. We did actually manage to steal leftovers from her. So we have five leftovers and the black glasses. But we're going back over here. And we're going to get cozy, and we're going to rematch some peeps. Nice. My birds are shivering. That's right. The new version came out and it patched the glitch from last time. That is good. That is good. Though I still have the old version. <laughs> it's fine. Anyways, I took a little break for a while because we tried to switch to Purity Forest. And that was some of the worst luck I've ever had there. Um, We had random Togepies using Metronome and getting Reversal. I took, like, over 100 damage and lost the run immediately. That was pretty unfortunate, wasn't it? This guy's got multiple Dodrios. He's actually perfect for training. As it stands right now, Raichu t needs three Thunderbolts to be able to KO Dugong. And Dugong is holding leftovers, so... A low roll will pretty much ruin that. So we've just accepted that we're going to take our time and level up. That's how the game is. When I whistle, bird Pokemon gather around. They're amazingly cute. The trainers in Victory Road weren't that tough. It's just that the Elite Four were a bit of a bit of a difficulty spike, so I don't have enough XP to even fight them. Even though I stole their leftovers too. Anyways, it's fine. The end of the last stream of this kind of just ended up being me accidentally bug testing the game, which is funny. Recharge, that's right. I took a little break, got some more cocoa and some water. I needed it. I'm not gonna lie, Purity Forest kind of like really started to sour my mood a bit. <laughs> like, after I just kind of got knocked down by getting randomly paralyzed like that, I was like, oh, there goes all those joy seeds in my inventory. That's the worst feeling. Okay, hit this right here. I decided, like, then and there, it's like, you know what? We should take a break. No one wants to see me attempt this when I'm really, really frustrated. You know what I mean? Or hangry. That's another reason to get a snack, too. Okay. 74 steps. There's a lot of trainers over here. 37. But I decided we're just going to go ahead, relax... And just slowly level ourselves up, because we kind of have to. There we go. I raised Pokemon for protection because I live alone. That hasn't changed. Okay. The fact that she lives alone hasn't changed. Good to know, Olivia. She still only has Bulbasaur, though, so who cares? I'll probably do more with Thief. Growth. <laughs> Hang on. Everyone needs a bit of level there. Snack was um, was yummy. Yeah, my mom has actually been um doing some baking lately and giving me some of the stuff she made. She has like these really good like um the, these chocolate chip muffins that she uses like very little sugar for, and they're very nice. Although on the flip side of that, she made a brownie cake, and my goodness, that was so sweet. Pokemon isn't about winning or losing for me. Good for you, lady. Good for you. Fork over all your cash when you lose, kid. Mmm. It was very yummy. Anyways, we're not gonna get uh, demotivated again, chat. It's a little bit later in the day because of, um... Essentially feeling like I wasted time on purity. But it's okay. I want to relax, and I want to see if I can beat this game. Even if I have to grind for a bit. Okay, three to special attacks, good. 
By the way, I should also mention, Lorelai's Jinx actually outspeeds Espeon. That's how good her effort values are. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, they're gone. And, okay, there's Weezing. 54 probably still isn't enough for Raichu, to be honest. I wish that I could battle trainers in, like, the 40s or 50s, but I can't. The only one available is Lorelei, and she's just too strong. She's too strong. All her Pokemon, no rest. Her Dugong's got leftovers. Let's let Charizard go. Even after I used all my remaining rare candies, it wasn't enough. There should be undefeated trainers around here. Let's try this. Yep, I'm back. Wait, what? Huh? Chat. Did I or did I not just cut that down once? Alright then. I think I found another bug right after they updated the game. You look gentle, so I think I can beat you. I'll give it a go. Cut missed. Did it say that? I was just kind of mashing the text. Trees are just regrowing a little fast. Literally unplayable, chat. Literally unplayable. Me at 561. Anyways, this is a certified comfy check now. Everyone is required to be comfy, including the streamer. Hang on, I should get my bear. There we go. Much better. No, you were joking? Okay. Don't tell jokes. You'll never know if you get it right by mistake. You're perfect. Help me train my little brother. All right, let's get comfy. Okay, this might not be a bad duo to take out. You're comfy right now. Gotta go to work soon. All right, no problem. Take out the Hitmonchan. It might Thunder Punch me, chat. That would hurt. Eh, not that much XP for these two. Critical hit. May as well pick up the item. What's cool and happening? Trading Pokemon. I love trading Pokemon. Said no one ever. Clefairy. You can't trade that. You can't send that to another dimension. Being very comfy is very required. Yes, it is. I said trade. I trade Pokemon with my friends. Rain dance, bleh. You guys have friends? I have a friend too. I'm holding it. Teddy Ursa. Okay, we took out what's over here. Let's just go ahead and battle some of these guys because I left them. We ride out here because the open space. These trainers were left undefeated, but they're kind of low level. <laughs> but again, we already beat everyone in Victory Road, so what can I do, right? Doesn't matter. We're not going to get pissy. We already used all that energy up in purity. Glad you're all doing good today, chat. Glad you're all still doing great. I feel bad when streams get a little scuffed like that, though. <laughs> I don't know if it's very fun to watch. But instead, I came back with a brilliant idea of grinding for hours to fight the Elite Four. <laughs> I shouldn't say it like that. Don't have lucky eggs, no. I could probably hunt for Chansey, but it's a very rare spawn, and it's not worth it. Chansey's too... Chansey's too uh, rare to even, like, attempt that can find it outside Safari Zone, but yeah, it's too its too much of a rare spawn. Let's get it. South of Cerulean there. Okay. We'll try, we'll try the forest again when I'm in a better mood. Blown away. I think my throat is okay now. For those that don't know, I kind of ended up having a sick night again, and yesterday my throat was sore as heck. I thought it was fine today, but the first chunk of the stream, it felt like it was hard to talk. I had to keep, like, pressing the mute button and just kind of clear it. That's the worst feeling. I can't have my anime character making, like, cough noises. That's gross. 708. Spam the flamethrowers, and everything shall be okay. How's the audio, by the way? 
I think the microphone is alright. I feel I had to reconfigure something about it this morning. Audio is good, audio is good, excellent. That Grimer is looking a little bit more pale. Ooh. It's gonna take a bit to get some XP, but it's alright. As long as I have money going into Lorelei, it'll be fine. There still isn't any post-game, so my goal for the day is just to get level up and beat the Elite Four. And I will- I think I definitely would come back to this playthrough. Or rather, this game with a new playthrough, like maybe try a Nuzlocke on it. Although, I feel like that would easily fall apart at the Elite Four. Yeah. For sure. Because I'm playing casually and I feel like the Elite Four just ruined me. Okay, here's Grimer. I don't even know what Bruno's got. That'll be fun. Let's see. We're so close to Banjo, we could play it Thursday. Ah, uh, not Thursday. I'm going out to dinner that day. I'm going downtown with a friend to eat out. What? You? Okay. Don't know what's in this grass. Sprouts? No problem. I'm actually looking forward to that chat. I haven't gotten a chance to actually, like, go out downtown in a while. Hmm. You'll be too busy Saturday? Oof. Well, I was kind of thinking Saturday might be a good day for that, to be honest. Alright, there's that. Have I beaten these guys? Yes, I have. Not you. They have TMs for sale in the Celadon department store. TMs aren't really rare, but look, not many people have HMs. Birdkeeper Beck sent out Pidgeotto. Mmm, okay. It's like BDSP where you get to the Elite Four and they're stupid strong. Yeah, I know, right? All the battles prior to this felt like I didn't really prep me. I wasn't really prepped for them at all. Excellent. Well, we'll see about doing it Sunday then, yeah. Hang on. Friday is when I'm planning to finish editing something for sure. Bird Pokemon should be ready for battle. I was doing a bit of editing yesterday and it's going well, but... There's, there was no sense in me staying up all night to try and finish it, so I'm just gonna wait till my next, like, free day to do that. Oh, right. Gust can hit you when you're in the air. I kind of forgot about that tidbit. What's he got? Spiro. Eh, it's whatever. <clears throat> Thursday, I was just going to do a short Mario Party thing there. <clears throat> Let me get some water. Speaking of me feeling like crap. No problem. Pretend that I'm animated and took a drink there, chat. Excellent. No matter what, though, this is going to be a fun week. We're not going to let a few little bit of bad luck in Purity Forest ruin our day. Streamer says as he struggles to talk. Haha. <laughs> It's fine. I'm fine. These guys are only given a little bit, but it's okay. Let's go ahead and swap the lead Pokemon. Charizard got to 51. Let Nido King or no, Blastoise the lowest level now. Along with Venusaur. A stretching animation would cost me a lot. You need to use TMs to teach good moves. Now, I've been doing that. It's not good enough, apparently. Hmm. All right. You know what I think it is? I think it's just like the changing of the seasons again. Whenever we, like, the weather drastically changes, like we go from winter to spring, like, uh, the change in temperature just, like, messes me up for a little bit. I know a lot of people are like that. It just irritates my throat, just makes my sinuses feel weird, and I just have to get used to it. There's not really a whole lot I can do about that. Ice beam... Get cool. No problem, no problem. 
No problem. Part of me trying to fix my seat. Who else is here to fight? I'm not gonna lose, not when the wind's blowing my way. Could make the stretching animation 6 FPS. Now, that, that doesn't magically make the animation super cheap. You, you still gotta pay for like different frames. Like, I only have a blinking animation and a mouth animation right now. Can you imagine it, like any kind of movement whatsoever would cost quite a bit. That's why we're saving for a 3D model. And then we gotta pay to get that one rigged and all set up. Excellent. Great day for me to plug everything, I know. Hey everybody, check out my stream. Everything's falling apart. By the way, I uh, I need money for this model. Could you help me with that? Chat, you, you, you wanna help me with that, right? You, you should, right? <laughs> You've been working on a small surprise for me with Fernie. Oh, really? Ooh. All right then, I guess we'll find out when I get it. Hydrate. I really should. I really should. If the stream disconnected right now, that'd be funny. It wouldn't be. It would be very funny for you guys, not for me. There's nothing funny about that. Anyways, chat. We're gonna enjoy the game. We're gonna get cozy. I know a lot of y'all, especially on YouTube, just have. We'll put this on in the background. So I don't want to spend it all day complaining about the stuff that went wrong, but it upsets me. That reminds me of the other day, actually. Hmm, pardon me. Um, I was watching a streamer try to play Resident Evil Zero, and unfortunately, the PC version of that game is super bad for PlayStation controllers for whatever reason. And she basically, like, spent an hour trying to get her controller to work and had to give up, and she felt so bad and, like, oh. I've been there. I've been there before. Every streamer has been there. That will happen one way or another. Ugh. Where you just assume stuff should work fine. And really, it should work fine because Resident Evil 1 Remaster, right? That came out before Resident Evil Zero's Remaster. For some reason, the PC version, even though those games should be like the same engine, they just messed up the controller mapping. Or the connection. Really sucks. Okay, let's do this. That Clefairy's looking a little sunburned. So let's drown it. Meowth. We're just going through these guys so I don't have to charge the Versus Seeker over and over. There's a few trainers you can rematch with evolved Pokemon, like the dude with the Dodrio. It's over already? Yay. Just gonna get our levels, and then we can go in and try again. Wow, your badges are cool. I could do a throwaway attempt on Lorelei to give the YouTube audience an, uh, an illustration of how how ridiculously tough she is. Hmm. You love Mr. Streamer? Well, I'm glad y'all like the stream. Planning to do something only for it to be ruined by inconvenience is awful. Yeah, that is annoying when it happens. Take a bite out of Poliwag. Perfect. Not enough. Okay. My cute Pokemon wish to make your acquaintance. There we go. No, no, no. This is a mod of this is a mod of Emerald, actually. Here comes Pidgey. No, I don't have any EVs left, really. We can't effort value train anymore. They're already too high level, and I've been training everyone for so long. Don't worry. After this, I'm going to take it easy and relax. I've got quite a bit recorded the past few days and plenty to upload. I started the Fallsbound Kingdom Randomizer, which is a ton of fun. It's actually, like, doing super great on YouTube as well. And you remember the other week when I played Paper Lily? I finally got around to getting that edited. And fortunately, it's too large to upload as one thing, so I, ha I got two three-hour VODs of it to upload. Okay. I'll get that one up when I can. Let me see. 
The last time I tried to render something past six hours, it ended up just like crashing the software when it was almost done. And I'm like, ah, I don't want to do that. Sure, I'll play with you, sweetie. I do want to play some more spooky games, yes. I really enjoyed Paper Lily, but um, there, there, was some, there was a little bit of annoying like puzzle stuff in that game that had me stuck for too long. That game gives you like multiple solutions in wide open areas. And I realized I spent like um, too long on one puzzle path that I literally locked myself out of at the start. And that was very annoying to find out. I feel like I wasted so much time. Yay. Oh, I'm still gonna upload giant VODs for sure. Let's do this. I'm just not sure if I want to, like, get Paper Lily up as one thing. I could see if it'll render. I'm told I'm good for a kid. Excellent. Oh, no, I think that's the issue, Yo-Yo, is, um... Uh, people who tried to write walkthroughs for Paper Lily, they didn't seem to understand that the multiple solutions thing was the main gimmick of the game. So they wrote down one solution just to rush their walkthrough out, and it, it was very obvious when you try to look up anything about that game. So as a result, it wasn't even possible to, like, get every, like, bad ending along the way. Okay, we'll do this. Susie sent out Meowth. Okay, we'll try this. Blastoise is slowly getting there. Blastoise is doing great. Maybe if I can, I'd like to play Dino Crisis, and I also kind of want to play Resident Evil 4 on the Wii again. I actually did that a few months ago, but um, the footage corrupted. And all I had was the very, like, 360p, like, Twitch recording, and I'm like, uh, I don't even want to bother editing this. Yep, stream is still going. I took, I took a bit of a break because the forest was mean. Okay. Ooh, I lost. Okay. Bird Pokemon want to battle you. Paper Lily was great, though. You know what? I'll, I'll, I'll try and upload it as one giant VOD. That probably might make it perform better. If I have more issues with rendering, then I'll just divide it up again. We got so much Yu-Gi-Oh! recorded this weekend anyway that we got more than enough to upload. 376. Pidgeotto is here. Pidgeotto is a friend. We're, for those wondering what I'm doing, I'm trying to level up my party because this game does not want me to succeed. I'll use Venusaur and the Fisherman. Alma's got a Goldeen. Okay, let's do it. Take a bite out of these fish. 52. Yeah, that's okay. Let's take a bite out of this thing, too. Ugh. You guys want me to continue Anacon? Um, I kind of wanted to restream those, but the problem with those games is that, is that they use licensed music that um, YouTube just instant claims. So I remember when I had to do the original recordings, I basically had to mute the entire game and put different audio in the background. <laughs> What's catching? You never know what you could catch. Fisherman Andrew would like to battle. A lot of indie visual novels do like just buy licensed music, yeah. Usually that's the safe route. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and keep biting the Magikarp. He's got a whole lot of nothing, and we're got a whole lot of something. Lost it. Okay, now that we've done that, let's take a look at our party. We'll go to Venusaur, yeah. Everyone is above level 50. Dugong is like level 55, 56. I remember that Lorelai's Jinx is level 58. Yeah, let's do it. I'm searching for a moonstone. Have you found one? Boy, you are real far away from those. Justin's got Nidoran. 
Well, this is the worst thing I could have sent out. How much do I do to him with this? Find out. Enough is the answer. Well. Let's just send an FB Espeon for a quick switch. <laughs> Too bad there aren't better, like, grass moves right now. I would love if I could just put Leaf Blade on Venusaur, but... It, around this time, your options were Razor Leaf or Solar Beam. Uh, and those weren't very fun options. At least in Gen 1, Razor Leaf was, like, a guaranteed critical hit. Giga Drain has no PP and only 60 power. An Iron... Well, if this works on anyone, we can use it. Okay. Um. Yeah, put on Espeon. What is that? Oh, it's a rocker. It's got the whole outfit. Electricity is my specialty. I don't know a thing about Pokemon of the Sea, though. Venusaur can't even get Petal Dance, can it? Dude, why has he got that? Like, how is he a rock star? He just looks like he's got, like, an electric thing. I never understood the sprite. Perfect. Razor Leaf. Well, don't worry, chat. We will get the chance to play a lot of games this year. Huh. You know me. I'm always gonna... I'm always gonna, like, overthink and worry about s stuff when it goes wrong for a little bit, but it's fine. He's a shocker. Yes, he is. Unplugged. Water conducts electricity, so you should zap C Pokemon. Thank you for telling me this. Nah, we're not gonna wake him. We're just gonna go around him like polite beans. Hey, Jess. If we win, I'll marry you. Oh, chat. Chat, chat. I get to, I get to ruin a relationship today. I love when I get to do that. Wow, they're even weak as hell, too. Oh, aren't I just so, so rude? Let's do this. Helping hand. Imagine you're about to get married to your significant other. And then, bam! Anime with multicolor headphones shows up and says, Nope. Your day's about to be ruined. Tried to use Helping Hand. She's setting him up to fail. This is her way of refusing. Oh, but why? You silly. You ruined this. Oh, Gia, forgive me, my love. Doesn't sound like a healthy relationship. I love fishing, don't get me wrong, but it'd be best if I had more work. It's challenge mode. They're the ones with the low-level mons. We've reached the point where their levels go around 20-something. <laughs> These guys aren't really the best to fight, are they? Now that we're on the other side of the Snorlax. Try using the Versus Seeker nearby other places, though. Boom. Divorced. Now, I have a Solar Beam TM, but having to charge Solar Beam is not good. Especially against the Elite Four, where they can just hit me with Double Ice Beam. Because my Venusaur is slow. Horsey is dead. Give him some XP. Hello. The Fishing Fool versus the Pokemon Kid. I don't know about setting up Sunny Day now. I don't think it's really worth it. They, again, they can just spam Ice Beam. I'm not worried about her Surf damage. Excellent. If anything, because of Lorelei's Leftovers, it's been better to set up Leech Seed against her instead. Be patient. Fishing's a waiting game. Weather in Gen 3 is very meh. Yeah, that's that's what I'm also thinking. 
In Blaze Black, I was able to cheese a few boss battles, like the gym leader fights, by specifically grabbing a Pokemon that had Drought or Drizzle. Because that game gave you access to that. Especially with, po with people like Clay, where they literally open the battle using a Pokemon with Sandstream. So the whole reason I just threw out the Whalmer with Driz Drizzle is just so he can't set up his stupid Excadrill at the end of the fight. Excellent. You have to outweather them. Yeah, I got a bite here. He's biting stuff, chat. Yeah, having chlorophyll would also be pretty nice. That would make it worth using the Sunny Day strat, but Venusaur's just got Overgrow. We're getting a teensy amount here. Fighting Pokemon half my level. In Gen 3, Venusaur only gets Petal Dance as an egg move. Oh. Well then. That's, that, that's silly. <laughs> Alright. Fun times ahead there. You know it's a silly a silly egg move for Bulbasaur in Gen 3 that I remember? I'm pretty sure Bulbasaur gets Grass Whistle as a as an egg move. And it's like why why would you ever want that? Get skill swap. It's like, hey, do you want worse sleep powder? No, oh, you do? Well make sure you breed your Pokemon specifically for it. So we've reached the end over here. Let's go over here. And how about you guys? Just keep battling, keep going. He gets it from the Oddish line in Gen 3. Gotta make Venusaur breed with a Vile Plume if it wants to learn that move. Shouldn't the Bulbasaur have like a Cherry Blossom Bud or something? That'd be very cute. Okay. Oh, heck yeah, I'm not breeding for a new Venusaur. Why would I do that? That'd be ridiculous. Clefairies are down. Clefairies are down. I will always be mean to Clefairies, because they're mean to me. Dude's on a winning streak. Let's end this. Okay, he's got that. What does the Mirror Herb do again? Isn't that like an item introduced in like Gen 8 or Gen 9? Hydrate? Don't mind if I do. At least the game speed in this is relatively fast, so I can easily go in and out of battles getting my XP. Gen 9, yeah. Okay. It allows you to get egg moves on Mons without breeding. Oh. Okay. Well, that sounds useful, I guess. What about all you chumps? Our twin power became better. I'll be the judge of that. Hang on, chat. I should go to gamer mode here. Let me put the bear down for a second. Fun fact, did you know if I set the teddy down, it immediately starts running towards the location of one of you chat members? You better watch out. He's gonna eat your snacks. First, you'll hear a knock at the door. Next thing you know, your pantry's open. Bam, all your cookies, eaten. That's the hidden threat, the hidden curse of having to hold the teddy. When you let him go, he needs to fill his appetite. Not if you eat them first. We may look silly standing here, but I can still battle. Why are they still standing there? They're just gonna stand there till the end of freaking time. Okay, no problem. This is what we got Sludge Bomb for. I want Venusaur to hit 52. The snacks you mean, not the teddy. Don't worry, I didn't think you meant you wanted to eat the teddy. I can't really... No, you can't really find Chansey Wild around here. Consistently, anyway. I know where to find low-level Chanseys, but... Okay, here goes that. Unless, you know what we could try? What about the area outside of Victory Road? 
Maybe there could be a Chansey spawn there. That might be worth looking into. That's the only thing I can think of. That depends. Were they there in Let's Go? Because I think the Chansey spawns are kind of like based on where they could appear in Let's Go. Because Let's Go did in general influence some of the spawns in this game. Here, let's ignore that last jump in for joy. I'm curious, so I'm gonna go try that. We can always fly out if it doesn't work. Perfect. Now let's go in here. I'm glad you're all still enjoying the stream. I get I get stupid self-conscious when stuff doesn't go as planned. Okay. But as y'all proved to me, y'all even watch me. Hang on. Watch me when I even have to grind like this for a while. So hang on, let's go. All the way over here. It'll take a little bit to reach, but it'll be worth it. If there's actually Chansey there. It's not even a guarantee it'll show up, though. It's not like Let's Go where we can chain catch. I think this is also where you get Execute and Let's Go, right? Oh, there we go. You know, I don't think this game is compatible with retro achievements yet, but I've been noticing there's actually a lot of Pokemon hacks that have uh, achievement sets. It's really cool. I kind of want to replay some of them on stream to do achievement hunting streams. Stuff like Kalos Crystal. Um, Pokemon Fool's Gold also has an achievement list as well. Renegade Platinum. Excellent. I was even thinking when I finally play Friends of Mineral Town on stream again, I was gonna, like, hook into the achievements for that. Does Emerald Rogue have a list for it? I might restart Emerald Rogue for that, if I could, to be honest. Okay, let's look around here, see what we have. Level 32. Not the best thing to fight with Vina. Hit it there. Does it actually, really? I know Emerald Rogue has its own built-in achievements, but an actual set on the achievement, uh, retro achievement site would be cool. I've only been playing Dawn of Sorrow on it so far, but I almost have 100% and it's been fun. Okay, there's Execute. Give it a bop. I know that Blue Kaizo has a list as well, and it looks as infuriating as you'd expect. Or special attack, that was worth it. Okay. Let's put Nido King up front now. Make a save, because you never know what can, something could go wrong. Perfect. Oh, I see a berry spot there. Eh. Perfect. I was talking a little bit about this earlier, but, um... Like, I used to grind achievements on PlayStation, but, like, eventually I just got so sick of doing it because so many games have, like, really, like, just unfair, impossible stuff. Or they have a bunch of shoehorned like, uh, shoe in uh, multiplayer stuff to kind of force you to get your friends to buy the game. And I just got, like, it, like, a lot of games aren't even fun to platinum anymore. Excellent. Just Earthquake you, I guess. If Chansey's here, it's probably like a really low spawn. Either way, these things are given decent XP. Oh, there's an Ultra Ball there. I didn't know that. Nice. Level 40. Okay. This should be fine to kill. Hmm. Retro achievements with Pokemon games account for the Pokemon you can't get. Yeah, they don't, like, require you to trade or anything. Like, if you look at the at the list for something like basic Pokemon Red, most of the achievements are just require you to, like, beat the game or beat each gym leader under, like, a certain, le like, level in, while, it's, while the game is on set mode or something. That could be kind of fun as well. Another basic stuff. I, I, one that seemed a little annoying, though, is collect every hidden item in the game. Which means you basically just have to have a checklist ready as you play through. 
you know, there are hidden items in that game that even I, like, don't memorize, because there's no point. <laughs> Boy. Go, go, go. Just seeing these two poison things and execute so far. No, they account for stuff that's impossible. The, the, the sets on Retro Achievements are always, like, possible to do. Not to mention, they also have an option where you can, like, wipe a game from your list if you don't want to do it anymore. And I'm just like... Th the fact that, like, uh, you can't do that on Steam, PlayStation, or Xbox is just, like, annoying to me. Especially, like, if you platinum a game and then they add a DLC trophy, that's, like, literally impossible. <laughs> Sifu really pissed me off for that. Those who don't know, like, so C that game Sifu, I played it, I platinumed it, and then they added, like, DLC trophies for, like, its arena mode. And one of them is requires you to beat, like, literally everything. And some of those challenges are literally just, like, impossible for a normal person to do. Even, like, the, sp like, the speedrunners were just like, this is literally ridiculous. What are they doing? What, like, you, one of them is just, like, you have to beat multiple waves of enemies. And as it goes on, like, you have to fight every boss in the game between certain waves. And to perfect it, it's like, you're gonna just, like, have not... Don't, don't get hit once, basically. And it's like, no, I'm not doing that. Screw you. <laughs> I'm not gonna learn to do that for a bronze trophy, so it says 100%. Get out of here. Excellent. I know, right? Just like, hey, oh, you completed the game? Well, now um, you'll never complete it. <laughs> Screw you, that's why. Ugh. That infuriated me. I needed that list to say 100% chat because I earned the 100% and then they took it away from me. Angry. All right, and then we'll do that. No chances, but it was worth looking here for that. <laughs> Spiro. I'm letting Nido King just hit level 52. And then I'll just go back to uh, trainers. Okay, let's get it. Perfect. Yay! That one's looking a little magenta. I'll sludge it. Back-to-back -back Spearows all of a sudden. Unfortunately, the Spearows give, like, next to nothing. Hello, friend. Welcome. Oh, we found it! Right as soon as I'm about to give up. Yo. Oh, wait. I should... I should get out Raichu and try to thief it. 1600. That's good. There's no guarantee they'll show up, right? Hang on. Raichu's holding an item anyway, but just in case we see another... If I got Lucky Egg, it, it's probably useless at this point because of how close we are, but... Let's do it. So we know high-level Chansey can show up here, but that was like, what? Maybe 20 to 30 encounters and I saw one of them? Can't really depend on that. It's nice. It's nice, though. You did call it. You did, in fact, call it. Okay. Oh, pardon me. Let me get some water. My throat feels amazingly better than it did earlier. I really did just have to, like, get used to talking and just let the gunk naturally get out of there, didn't I? Okay. Let Charizard get another level, I guess. Let's go, go, go. I wonder about getting the Super Rod. I wonder if that would have been good for training in some areas, but eh, it doesn't matter. A Teddy can come back later. I just unleashed him to steal someone's snacks. There we go. 281. Excellent. 
Sorry it took me a bit uh, since the last stream of this game to get back to it. I, I was fully expecting to be able to beat the game last week, and I wasn't expecting the Elite Four to be so brutal. Okay. We'll do this. Let me scratch. My, my back is really itchy all of a sudden. Hang on. I need to awkwardly just, like, scratch one spot there. Pretend my character is animated enough to, to move around. <laughs> Everything is fine. Okay, I'm gonna flamethrower this, and then we're gonna move on. Okay, perfect. 286. Anything else here? We got good old Nidorino. All right, I, I, I kind of want to just like go make an attempt on the Elite Four again, but I'm not fully confident we'd be able to make make it too far. <laughs> but we'll find out in a second. We'll find out in a second. Charizard's a bit low, but we did this for a bit. Better give Raichu the leftovers again. Just so I can illustrate to everybody I'm not exaggerating here. We've been grinding for like, what, 45 minutes? Not bad. Handful of levels have been distributed. We need to go ahead. Raichu needs to be up front. And give him the leftovers. We stole enough for everyone earlier. I got a handful of money. We need to spend most of it. As long as I have a little bit of money on me. There we go. Saving the game. Don't turn off the power. Okay. Now let's see if you guys... Well, let's just give you guys a demonstration of how bad she is. Let's see if I can at least two-shot Dugong now. Highly doubt it. Still not on the same level as you. I'm scared to see- I can't even take it down to half, damn. I'm still kind of scared to see what the next uh, Elite Four member is going to have. There's not much in the way of held items for Gen 3 Kanto, is there? Leftovers guarantee we're not killing you. Can I live this? Nope, she got a critical hit. Chat, that is like the fifth or sixth time I've tried this today and she gets a critical surf on Raichu. Like, I literally can't even like, I can't do anything to her. It's so stupid. <laughs> All right, Venusaur, get in there. Get in there. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Yeah. She's gonna rest now. More full restore. Yeah, she could do that too. And I do no damage because this thing's a tank. Just gonna do this now. Mm-hmm. Almost dead. My favorite. <laughs> Here we go. Everyone's favorite slow-ass battle. I'm gonna do this before you... Nice. Okay. I don't want her to rest. She can't rest. Not around me. Never. Reminder, it's still her first Pokemon. <laughs> if I could get a crit with Razor Leaf, that'd be cool. Nope. Oh, right. Yeah, sleep talk. I just didn't want her to use rest to heal everything. I know she has sleep talk. There we go. Any day now. Any day. Let's see if I can kill it. Oh, good, a crit. Good, I can be happy again. Only a tiny bit for Vina. And here comes Jinx. Which is going to kill me in one hit. <laughs> I 
All right, Charizard, you're up. You need to spam Flamethrower against it. She went fake tears right away. So now I'm going to die in one Ice Beam or Psychic. Absolutely. Get one shot her, and she has a Citrus Berry. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Do you see what I mean? Look at this battle. Why is she so much more powerful than literally everything before this? She still outspeeds Espeon. Okay. Well, Espeon's dead. Yeah, we just sit here to die. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like we're back to the back to training right after this one. And Charizard could just be strong enough to outspeed. Thank goodness you're missing those. That's the only reason I got that. Might stand a chance at level 70. Yeah. Maybe. Getting T-bolted. <laughs> There's nothing I can even do to this thing, damn it. Except make it flinch over and over. And we zapped. Now we send in Nido King. Give her a little brick break. Or nothing. <laughs> we lost again, everybody. She took my money. Yes, yes, Miss Joy. I know what I need to do here. You just heal me up, and I'll be on my way. Well, that didn't work out. So, just like that, I am once again unable to do anything. And that's why I'm training the way I am right now. Okay. I need to give... I need to give uh, another level to Raichu for sure. Let's go down here. How about you guys? He's warmed up, ready to go for a swim. Only tentacool. Bleh. You can see what I mean. The thing that worries me the most now is not just Lorelai, the what about the trainers after her? Like, what level is the rival going to be at the end? Am I going to be able to even do that? Okay. All warmed up now. Now, why don't we just go find some chumps over here to fight? I don't think I could punch her cloister. What if I could? I know that Raichu can one-shot cloister with Thunderbolt. I basically need Raichu to, like, sweep her. 42. There's all of them. They're weak. We want these guys. The water is shallow here. That's why people are swimming. But you're out in the middle of the ocean. Like the people in Hoenn. This is okay. We're A-OK, we're a -okay, chat. <laughs> we're A-OK. -okay. Probably couldn't punch a Lapras either. No. I wouldn't want to take, um... There's a lot of Pokemon I wouldn't try and take in a fist fight. I wouldn't want to take many Pokemon in a fist fight anyway. Like, why would I want to punch them? Can you imagine me squaring up against a Teddy Ursa? I guess I could kick a Cleffa. Why are you riding a Pokemon? Haven't you learned to swim yet? There we go. Darren's got a horsey. Just keeping it... Give more of it a... 
keep zapping it a bit. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> I could just go... No, I can't even go catch Wobbuffet to cheese her. I have to do that in a lot in Pokemon Stadium, though. Okay, the trainers here got some evolved Pokemon. It's not too bad for Raichu. Clearly, all of the Elite Forest Pokemon have good IVs and EVs, though. They're toughy. They're super tough. But it's okay, because we're going to win, chat. We just need to get over the first hurdle. That is Dugong. All right, battle. Okay, let's go ahead and hit you. Please let this be a good level up. I need it. Please, please. Please, game. I was breezing through the mid-game a lot, too, wasn't I? The difficulty spike was, is just unreal getting here, isn't it? Maybe fight the wild Pokemon in here? What can we run into here? Oh, whoopee. Level 26 Zubat. Don't think this is the place for us. Yeah. Open it. She wants to fight. Let's try it. I don't really want to go take out the legendary birds just for a small amount of XP. That wouldn't really work, especially since they don't respawn. That wouldn't be smart. Have the legendary birds ever respawned? I feel like, um... Maybe, maybe they do in Let's Go. Damn, that's all she got. Okay. Let's go over these chumps again. I want one more level on Raichu, so I could probably two-shot Dugong. 22. There we go. Think they do in Heart Gold Soul Silver if you beat the Elite Four. Yeah, if you make if you make them faint instead of catching. Alright, let's do it then. There's no way to respawn the beasts or any legendaries in Gen 2 though, right? If they die, they're just gone for good. To this day, even if a Pokemon will respawn, I will just, like, freaking, uh, I will save in front of that thing. Okay, no problem. Come to think of it, isn't there no way to get Moltres in this game right now? It's not in Victory Road, and there is no, uh, Mount Ember yet. Take it out. 568. Ouch, torpedoed. Water shallow here. Yes, it is, buddy. You know what else is shallow? Your Pokemon. You got no skills. Fire Red Leaf Green was actually the first to have the legendaries respawn, apparently. Oh, can they? I didn't realize. Come on. We need this, chat! We need this! Oh, I'm out of... Oh. Well then. I'm out of Thunderbolts. I use them all up. However, Thief counts as special, so we can hit him. There's no point going through Seafoam. Yeah, it's not worth it to kill, like, the, the Elite... Not the Elite Four. Uh, Articuno for a small amount of XP. It's not worth it. Okay. Could just go to the Dodrio guy right quick. After I heal up Raichu. <laughs> I think the thing is, like, it's not the, 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 the Elite Four that's too strong. It's the trainers before the Elite Four that are too weak. 
Like, the, I, I, I'm playing this on challenge mode, I know, but the issue I found is that, like, a, pretty much, like, all most of the mid-game trainers were actually pretty easy. And the gym leaders weren't too much of a hassle after, like, the first couple I found. Do this. Ah, he didn't want to fight. Wait, what? Didn't he say he wanted to fight? Try the Discord, asking where a good place to, um... Uh, a good place to grind is, and people just use Victory Road. Other people are asking for a good place to grind, too. Alright. I'm just- I- I just think some of the main trainers should be a little stronger. Because I felt like they- even on Victory Road, there was a lot of unevolved Pokémon, and they were kind of easy. Okay. No, there's no, um, there's no one island to go to at all after Blaine, so I don't even have- I don't have that either. I'm gonna take you out, I'm gonna get Raichu to level 56, and I'm gonna see if he can simply just zap that dugong away for good. Please let it zap it away for good. Who's left? Oh, come on. This is the worst trainer I could have fought with Raichu. <laughs> oh, I couldn't kill it. That's fine. All right, let me get a drink here. Not good enough. Well, now I gotta heal that poison. Use a full heal. Everything should be okay. Just let me find a, a, a trainer or a wild Pokemon to beat up. Or just bump into these. Gimme. Okay, 56. Three to special attack, we can take that. Okay, I'm gonna fly back to the Elite Four and see if we can do this. I just really need to get past the first hurdle that is Lorelei's Dugong. And I need Raichu for that crap. The Chansey is changing colors. That just means it's a different Chansey on a different shift. It's totally not the game just randomizing stuff. No, 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 no. That would make no sense. Okay, game saved. Going in. Two levels stronger since last time, girl. Let's see if this ha this this helps me out. Too risky to go for the Thunder Wave at the start. It'd just be pure RNG. I can't even take it down to half still. <laughs> Why won't this thing take damage? What did I do? Man. Okay. Can I have a critical hit and just get rid of it, please? It went to sleep. Okay. Ooh, chat. All right, hang on. I should just get my, I get my angie face on here. I can just rest out of Thunder Wave anyway. Ah. Oh, that took it to half. Have I just been getting like bad low rolls? Tried to rest again. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> so much fun. Sleep talk. Let's try to rest again. Okay. I get to kill it because uh, I got lucky. Except she's going to full restore. Hoping for the uh, the paralysis through Thunderbolts, 
Because I need to do the damage. I can't just use Thunder Wave. We're hoping for a critical Thunderbolt. Oh my. That Surf surprisingly did little damage this time. Dugong is down. All right. Yeah, send out Cloyster. Send out Cloyster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many Thunderbolts did that take me? The answer is too much. I'm like half out of Thunderbolts on one Pokemon. Wow. Okay. Here comes the bro. Keep eating that endless apple core, baby. Keep eating that. Nice. Come on. I can just hit him with one more. One more. Excellent. Mm, okay, what's next? There's the Jinx. I know what you're going to do. I know what you're going to do. We're shutting you down, girl. All right, Charizard, this is your chance. This is your chance. Come on. Come on. Almost. Fine. Your citrus berry goes off. We took her out. Oof. And now all that's left is Lapras. I know what I'm not going to be able to do. You missed. We're going to make sure we can take this thing out, Chad. We're going to make sure we take it out. Go on, kill me. Yeah! Yeah, we're doing it! I told you all I needed was a Raichu. I hit it with two smoke screens. And critical hit. Screw me, I guess. Okay. Have Blastoise go for the the flinch lock, maybe, <laughs> while I drain it. My pissy face stays on, chat. Do you see why we spent the past hour grinding? Because even that was still not enough at all. This is the last Pokemon now, right? Damn it. Everybody's buffed here. Oof. Oh. Okay, you're down. Is she gonna full restore? We're gonna find out. Smokescreen made a miss a few times. Come on! Might be best to go for the flinch. Good. They're at minus two accuracy. I can make them flinch and drain them with the seed. Nice. Not enough. Oh, that's good. Things shouldn't be this way. Oh, girl, do not, do not talk to me like that. You better, better than I thought. Go on ahead. You only got to taste the League's power. Well, then. This might very well be a uh, reset in front of every Elite Four member type of run chat. Because <laughs> I don't think I can consistently even get past Lorelei without freaking... Training for several more hours. Yay. 
So we got Bruno. I highly doubt Bruno is gonna lead with Onyx. Or maybe he'll have Steelix, actually. Uh, Charizard can fly against something. She absolutely deserved that crap, you're telling me. Make sure I have... I of course I have money. There we go. Make a save. Be a little brave. I'm Bruno of the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, people and Pokemon become stronger without limit. I've lived and trained with my fighting Pokemon, and that will never change. Red, we will grind you down with our superior power. Hoo-ha. Five Pokemon? Yep. He's... Excuse me. Excuse me. You want to tell me that Lorelei gets a freaking leftovers bulky freaking dugong, but Bruno still starts with an onyx? And he's faster than me. Of course he is. You get what you freaking deserve. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, wow. He's got a polyrath. Look at him go. Okay, he's probably gonna go for a fighting move. Do I want to safely swap in you? Or do I want to throw Venusaur? Now Venusaur is probably the best one for this. Oh, he's going Focus Punch. It looks like his levels are, are the same as Lorelei right now. Damn, that did a lot. Ice Beam. Damn. Ah, well, I'm on set. That's why I had to switch like that. Let's do it. Espeon, this is what we trained you for. This is what all that friendship was for. You can do this, right? You can do this, Espeon. Please, 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 please. You need to do this for me. You literally need- yes, yes, good boy. Chat, I'm so proud of this Espeon. I'm so proud. Did a Hitmonlee. Did, did, did a Hitmonlee just outspeed me? Ah! You're gonna full restore. Come on, come on. Chat. 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 This feels illegal. How can a Hitmonlee... I don't care if there's a five-level difference. You can't be allowed to leave, live that. No! He used another already? Ah, oh, I need to see... I need to save Espeon. Hmm. Do this. I need to save Espeon from a champ. Rock slide, damn. He's gonna earthquake me. I'm gonna die, but that's okay. I just need the safe switch in. He's got rock slide for Charizard, no doubt. And he's gonna have, oh, I have to use Blastoise for this. Oh, that's bad. All right, jump kick. Torrent, come on. Not enough. Well, this is pretty bad. I'm gonna have to quick attack with both Mons because for some reason he's faster than Espeon. Okay, Espeon should be in range to finish him off with quick attack. Critical hit. Come on. Get it. The frog is down. Plus four special attack. We take that. Now there's no way in hell you outspeed me. You're level 60. Okay. Hey. 
Go! Oh, he lived too. He missed. He missed, chat. He missed. He missed. He missed. You get what you deserve. What are you doing? Citrus berry? I first tried Bruno, but Lorelei took me several hours. Okay, then. <laughs> Let's heal everybody. Right now. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay. Espeon got a well-deserved level there. What is going on today? <laughs> it's so difficult. All right. So next up we have Agatha, which means Espeon is going to need to sweep here. Hmm. Her Gengar is probably absolutely going to outspeed Espeon, though. Can use Nido King to Earthquake the non-ghost types. We'll have to go ahead and save and see what the speeds are. Okay. Make a save. I'll show you how a real battle goes. Sorry, her dialogue's the same. I'm just used to mashing here. Mashing in the Elite Four, I mean. Okay, let's do it. Willow Wisp? You you wanna burn Espeon? Okay. And I synchronized burned, yeah, okay. Your shadow ball is useless now. Thunderbolt? Okay. Come on. Oh, <laughs> yes. boy. Best investment I ever made. Can't believe it didn't have Shadow Ball. Oh, it, it wouldn't have Shadow Ball because Shadow Ball counts as physical. Why would they give it that to a cracked uh, Gengar? Golbat outspeeds Espeon. Cool. Well, I can Ice Beam with Blastoise. There's that. Let Blastoise try and get some XP during this madhouse of a gauntlet. Well, I got poisoned. Half damage. Half damage. <laughs> oh my Raichu get in there and thunderbolt this brat <laughs> please yes 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 take it out almost got another level there okay we got Arbok now you're intimidating me Oh, wait, you're gonna have Shed Skin. No, wait, you have Intimidate, not Shed Skin. We just saw this. Okay. Golbat having a freaking really strong Sludge Bomb there, yeah. Earthquake! How could you? Let's do it. Let's do it. Chat, get your game face on. Hold up your wholesome bears. It's go time. Nice. No defense. Just my, my favorite. Okay, she got wheezing like, let's go. Nothing Nido King can really do to this, so that's fine. Just hit it for a small amount of damage. Fire blast, okay. Okay, is it gonna go boom? Should probably paralyze it to play it safe. Okay, not bad. Uh-oh, that's bad. As we went over, I have no def- eh, critical hit. Chat, chat, is it just me or is everyone in the Elite Four just getting so many critical hits? 
Yet my Razor Leafs get like one in a critical hit every 30 uses. <laughs> All right. Um... Nothing you can really do. Hang on. I gotta set it up with Leech Seed. That's all Venusaur can do if it comes down to it. It's trying to burn me. Okay. She hasn't used a full restore yet, right? It's gonna go for Fire Blast. Charizard's a safe switch in. Come on. Paralyzed, you can't move. Mm, I don't want to- I want to keep you out of full restore range, though. So let's do this while you get whittled down, because even if you full restore... Yes. And then I'll use the flamethrower when you're in just the right range. Come on. No problem. Okay. Go for it. You got this. Oh, yes. We did it. You win. I see what the old Duff sees in you now. I have nothing else to say. How I beat Bruno and Agatha first try, but Lorelai just took me in a, an eternity and a half right there. I haven't even needed to reset yet. Yay. We might actually be able to pull this off. The grinding was absolutely necessary, though. The biggest hurdle was, like, Raichu needed, needed to absolutely kill the Dugong. The Dugong was a gatekeeper. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Okay. How many revives do I have left? I have one max, and... 19 regular. More than enough. Yeah, at this rate, I'm getting so much XP, it might be better if I do kind of lose. But that depends on what the levels actually are, right? Yay. So, assuming he still starts with Gyarados, we want Raichu up front. Four Thunderbolt should be enough. Aerodactyl worries the hell out of me. Hmm... How many Psychics does Espeon have left? One. Hmm. Ether, Elixir... Do I have Lepa Berries to just use up as well? I have 11 Lepa Berries, damn. Okay then. Let's use them on Psychic and one on Thunderbolt. Hello friend, welcome. Okay, chat. Let's make a save again. Get our game face on. Let me see. I've heard about you, Red. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. There's no being clever with them. Well, you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me. All right, let's do it. Holy moly. I'm doing okay now that I'm past Lorelei. She was the main issue. Okay, I thought so. His first Pokemon's level 60. Oh, goodness. Th there's no way you live this. There's literally no possible way you survive this attack. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Stay dead, Gyarados. Okay, here comes Dragonite. And he outspeeds and has Earthquake. <sighs> Alright then. This is what we learned Ice Beam for, chat. This is what we learned Ice Beam. We're gonna turn him into a Freezy Pop. Hidden Power? No, no, no. What type was that? What type was that? Yes! Yes! Citrus? That's what I thought! It's 
stretch? Don't mind if I do. All right. Oh my goodness. I should be happy again. Yes, I am. What do we got left? Oh, yeah, let, let's go, team. All right. <laughs> hmm. Aerodactyl will kill Blastoise anyway at this rate. Hmm. What's he even going to go for? Hydro Pump? Okay. Hmm. Send an SB on here. Give it a blast. Nice, one shot. There's Jerry Zard. Come on, let's go for it. Okay, I got the drop. What are you, what are you doing? What, what? No, 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 you can't do that. Stop that, cut that out. Please put him in, please put him in freaking quick attack range. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> oh, thank goodness I got the drop in special defense. Aerodactyl's gonna slaughter. Oh yeah, it's time, chat. Hidden power. Uh, okay. He, he really just went for the not very effective hidden power. Rock slide. No! I'm about to go down. You're getting damaged anyway. It was probably hidden power fighting. Okay, she's got rock slide. That's not good for Charizard, clearly. He's gonna have earthquake probably too. He probably has a stab flying move. Damn it. He's doing hidden power fighting? Why? Come on. He's gonna go into full restore range. Come on. Stay angry, I need the rage. Okay, I'll stay angry. Critical hit razor leaf. If I've ever needed a critical hit razor leaf in my whole life. Please, please. It's not going to be enough. Should have tried Sludge Bomb instead. Will that do more? No, it's not very effective on Rock. <laughs> if you think it was normal tight, or sorry, neutral for a second. Okay, we got him. We got him. Come on. This is the intense battles you all signed up for. He's fast asleep. No, it's okay, friend. I I committed to the play. It's not your fault. You forgot. Okay. Come on. Is he gonna do this again? He woke up. No. Don't hit and power me, Aerodactyl. Please. Anything but that. I win. Oh. Now ain't that something. I can't believe I've been able to cheese my way through three of these guys first try, but Lorelei was just an absolute disaster. That's it. Wow. I can't believe my dragons lost to you, Red. You're now the champion, or you would have been, but you got one more challenge left. There's one more trainer to face. His name is Blue. He beat the Elite Four before you. He's the real league champion. All right, then. This is exciting, you're telling me. Okay, um... Do I have any status conditions on me? No, I do not. Where's my... Where the hell's my hyper potion? There they are. Time to revive, everybody. Okay. 
Now, who does the who would the rival start with? I don't actually know. Hmm. Okay, do that. Um I can't remember what he usually would lead with. He might have his Pidgeot, yeah. In that case, I probably could keep Raichu up front. Okay, chat, so here's the thing. Champion music still continues to get, like, ridiculously claimed all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and just play something else. Hang on, hang on. Let me go ahead and just do this. Mute the audio. There we go. And play something else. Thank you, SoundCloud rappers. I know. Alright, this should do. This should do just fine instead. As long as an ad doesn't play in the middle of it. Hey, Red! I was looking forward to seeing you. I did save, right? Please tell me I just saved. <laughs> I was looking forward to seeing you, Red. My rival should be strong to keep me sharp. While working on my decks, I looked all over for my Pokemon. Not only that, I assembled teams that would beat any type. And now I'm the league champion. You know what that means? I'll tell you. I'm the best powerful trainer in the world. All right, you little scum sucker. Let's do it. I did save. Thank you. All right. What you got? Yep, he's starting with Pidgeot. Let's see if we can sweep Raichu. He's going double edge. Okay. That's stab. Oh, give me a goddamn break. <laughs> All right, then. This is great. He's going double edge. You did not do that much damage to Blastoise. I refuse to believe that. Why is he still alive? Oh, my. Oh, my goodness gracious. All right, then. He went aerial ace. He killed me. He got a critical hit. Guess what? Wow, he critical hit. So much skill. Such greatness. <laughs> okay. He outspeeds Espeon. Everyone outspeeds Espeon, apparently. This is great. Yeah, he crits. Well. <laughs> kind of screwed now. Getting sweeped by Double Edge. Cool. Cool game. Oh. Cool. Take yourself out. Get, kindly remove yourself from the battle, Pidgeot. Mm hmm. You got Marowak. If that thing has the club, I swear. It probably does. Well, can outspeed you. He's earthquaking. Oh boy. Yeah. I pretty much have to get a freeze with Blastoise or it's impossible. That's pretty rough. <laughs> Thank you, friend, for the for the five months. I appreciate it. Highly doubt Venusaur can uh, solo this crap right here. Okay. There is no chance in hell I am starting this over from the beginning. There, that, that, is, that, that is simply not happening. The only reason I'm even this far right now is because of a lot of R good RNG rolls. All right, it's over. Hang on. Yeah, let's go in here. We're gonna have to put Blastoise up front. Go ahead and save again. Let's do it. All right, buddy, let's try this again. He has freaking double edge on that Pidgeot and it does so much because of stab. He's just like there to delete anything that comes out. That's pretty rough. Okay. He crits, it's over. I need a critical ice beam or a freeze. 
Nope. Okay, he's going full restore. We got another chance. Come on. Okay, I got the freeze. He defrosted. He quick attacked. All right, then. Reset. I'm about ready to just use items in the battle. I'm, I'm not going to lie. That'd be kind of a bad way to end on this, but I... I really don't want to go grind for five hours just to be able to say I beat this without items, to be honest. Can you blame me? All right. Let's do it again. All right. Especially since he's using full restores anyway. All right. He's quick attacking. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Let's be happy. And take him out now. Alright, let's do it again. Because at this point, the only way I can even get a chance at this battle... I need the critical ice beam or the random freeze, that's all. Oh, he rolled high that time. <laughs> Otherwise, my whole team just gets deleted by him. Okay. Go for it. Let Teddy see. Sure, we can summon Teddy. Teddy can enjoy the battle, too. Uh, even with this setup here... Everyone just dies one hit to him. I still need that random crit, even with items. That's the problem. I think they really overdid the, 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 the difficulty spike in this. Alright, let's do it again. Not only do I need to grind to get past Lorelei, I have to basically grind to, like, prepare for this thing, too. Alright, let's do it again. Double edge. Critical hit, please. Oh, he didn't go for his thing this time. Come on. Yeah, and now um, I'm just going to get swept again. All right. Oh, man. I'd have to get the team to, like, all mid-60s or something at this rate. All right. I'm not, it's not even safe to heal up anyone unless I get the critical ice beam, too. Come on. Probably holding the silk scarf, too, for all we know. He, lo he rolled low that time. Okay, there's the freeze, but he's gonna full restore. Oh, he's not? Okay, I think this is the run. Hang on. Perfect. The menace is down. He's going Jolteon. So let's go ahead. Ah, uh, he's gonna go for an electric move. Does he have an answer to Nido King though? We'll have to find out. I don't think his Jolteon was always that color. Level 67. 67? I was joking when I said they get close to 70. Damn. Oh, he really can't do anything to Nido King. This is good. Hang on. Oh. All right. Hang on. I need to reset the music before it plays an ad or something. <laughs> Let me just do that. He's going full restore. I'm making him waste his stuff here. Hang on. I haven't needed to use items yet. Let's not count it over. Hidden power what? Crystal Kaizo flashbacks. <sighs> Super effective! You jerk. Probably water or ice. Okay. Now here comes Marowak. Yay. Screw it. 
<laughs> I, I don't care at this point. I'm gonna do this. Double edge. Oh, he's got that too. He didn't need to use his big one on me. Now we'll just send out you. King did his job. He took out the rival's Jolteon. Oh? Well, you're gonna regret that. Oh, well, all right, free. This is free. Critical hit, good. Doesn't matter what XP we get here. Vile Plume, the shiny. Okay, he's gonna go for Sludge Bomb or the raw freaking damage on me there. Ah, I kinda need a sacrificial switch in here, don't I? Not safe to send in Raichu for free. Outspeed me. Mm, can Venusaur wall most of what it does? I can't leech seed Vile Plume though. You can't leech seed grass, grass types. What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, let's do this. Let, let let's do this. This could get rough. It's already buffed. I need to hope it stays asleep while I psychic sweep it. All right, let's do it. Go for it again, and there we go. 801. Here comes the slow bro. I'm gonna bite it now. He's going T-Wave on me, okay. I synchronized him, which means I can just be a little piece of crap and, and heal it. Because I'm going to. Because I'm filled with spite now. Oh, are you paralyzed? Poor baby. Bite. Oh, he rested. All right. He's probably going to have sleep talk or something. I'm going to send in Raichu and Thunderbolt it now. Oh. Okay. Come on. Come on, just a bit further. Give it a little shock. Please let this kill. Please let this kill. I can't take it anymore. I can't take it anymore. He's still alive. <sighs> Yay. All right. Let's go. Just keep going. Just a bit more. Please take it out. Why won't you die? All right. I'm having fun, chat. I love Thunderbolting into full restore. It's my favorite Pokemon combo. I didn't even take him to half that time. Damn. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Keep going. Any day now. Any day now. Sorry, I'm peeking the microphone. I'm, getting a little, I'm a little too close to it when I'm pissy like that. I need to put the angry face on the bear. So help me, you do this one more- Oh! <laughs> I don't want to hear a single person mad I used a, a revive or full restore when I'm doing this. I don't want to see a single person upset about that. <laughs> just, just, just die already. Please just die already. Oh, how many do you have? How many does he have? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's try this again. I'm gonna do this now to him, though. Oh, man, this is BS right now, isn't it? I, I, it feels like he's used like four or five of them at this point. Isn't it like four supposed to be the max in Gen 3? A trainer can have uh, an item assigned to them? Oh damn, he hit the T-Wave. <laughs> okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, he rested again. Cool. 
Oh, I should uh, hang on. I may as well reset the music while we wait. <laughs> Just so it doesn't play like an ad in the middle of it all. Well, oh wait. You know what? You know what? I'll use one. Bam. How do you like that? Get the YouTube engagement. You're totally right. Chad, I'm about to run out. Of, I'm about to run out of thunderbolts. All right then. Let's hope these are enough. Fast asleep. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. So close. He woke up. He used thunder he used thunder wave. He rested again. <laughs> now to heal my paralysis. I don't I need I need to hang on. I need to use an ether on me or something now. <laughs> Let me just use a Lepa Berry. I got lots of those. Oh, I'm having so much fun. Come on. He's still asleep. Critical hit. Please, I'm begging you. He should be in range to die. Come on, please. We, we hit him with Thief beforehand. Stop it. Stop it right now. Stop it right now. Here we go. I'm paralyzed. I can't move. Yay. <sighs> All right. Here we go. Let's do it again. Either this or we can go beat up like uh, little Jenny's like level 30 Nidoran for two hours. Take your pick, chat. What sounds more fun? Kill. 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 Oh, thank God, it's dead. <laughs> what the hell was that? One left. Oh, it's Rapidash. It's probably gonna outspeed me. So I'm gonna hit it with a quick attack while I can. Oh, nice. You just lowered your special. Chat, we got it. We got it. We absolutely got this now. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Oh, and we paralyzed it too. Come on. Who's left? Who's left? Okay, Charizard can use your Earthquake. Come on. Come on. Come on. It ends now. What? Of course it hit. Of course it hit. No. No, chat. No. I said no. That's right, you can't move. You're gonna die, you're gonna die, and this is gonna be the end. This is gonna be the end. This is gonna be the end. That's right. We did it. We did it. Teddy's win. Teddy's win. Yes! Okay, hang on, I can start I can change the music now. Bop 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 bop. Let me let me turn it on. Audio. There we go. Wow, I can't believe I beat him first try with no, with with uh, out using items. No, it can't be. You beat me at my best. After all that work to become the champion, my reign is over. There we go. Why did I lose? I never made any mistakes raising my Pokemon. Darn it, you're the new champion. Although I don't like to admit it. Hey, Red. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry if that upsets you, but I there's nowhere to grind. Except fighting the Elite Four over and over, and I can barely do that consistently. I basically had to cheese them with RNG the whole way through. And then that double-edged Pidgeot made it me just be like, no, no, not again. So you won! Sincerely, congratulations. Chat seems to be in full agreement that <laughs> that stuff was justified. You're the new champion. You've grown up so much since you first left, first left with Pikachu to work on the decks. You've come of age. Blue, I'm disappointed in you. I came when I heard you beat the Elite Four, but when I got here, you already lost. Do you understand why you lost? You have forgotten to treat your Pokemon with love and trust. Without them, you'll never become champ again. It seemed like BS. Yeah, I think it was, the Elite Four was kind of a giant spike in difficulty, yeah. Again, maybe if like the trainers before that were tougher, it would have better prepared me, but it seemed like the, the, the tra regular trainers were just like regular trainers the whole way through, even on challenge mode. Oh. Red, 
You understand your victory was not just your own doing. The bond you share with your Pokemon is marvelous. Red, come with me. I just didn't want to go versus Secret People for three more hours. We already did, like, maybe, like, two and a half hours total of uh, training on the versus Seeker. And only an hour of that is in this recording, because we got so sick of it earlier. Mm-hmm. Congratulations, Red. This floor is the Pokemon Hall of Fame. Pokemon League champions are honored for their exploits here. Their Pokemon are also recorded in the Hall of Fame. Red, you have worked hard to become a champion. You and your Pokemon are Hall of Famers. Okay. Ooh. The difficulty seemed all over the place. Yeah, it was difficult at first. And then the mid-game was pretty... Re felt relatively easy. And then the end was just like, I, I, well, I hope you're prepared for Lorelei and friends. Oh, well. I'm not trying to bitch. I'm just kind of saying, like, it was really noticeable how difficult it got. Excellent. All right. And, yeah, I kind of wanted to just, like, wrap up the game because we've been so close for a bit. I couldn't even finish it last week. Someone needs to count how many full restores he used at the end there because that slow bro was upsetting me. Hang on, I think I need to mute the credits music, though. League champion, congratulations. Yes, I do. Okay. Credits theme in this game gets claimed. Or Fire Red Leaf Green credits theme gets claimed, I should say. Is it actual credits for the for the mod team? Or, or like, the actual... Um, Hang on. Okay, it is. Okay. Because if it was just the, the regular game credits, I would just, like, skip through that. But it's the actual mod one. Wait. Oh, is it the same one every time? Hold up. Okay, there we go. All right, all right. Oh. Okay, there. And then a decade later, these two characters vacation in Hawaii again. All right. Yeah, I did enjoy this a lot. Like, like, don't get me wrong. I, I do definitely think that even, the, like, yeah, it got diff really difficult towards the end. It certainly felt a bit, um... It was fun all the way through. Um... Let me see. Yeah, Jerry's Zard. Look at him go. Now, I think, like, I was pretty much able to breeze through the most of the game, for sure. It just felt like, um... My God, I'm just a broken record right now. Again, I think the mid-game was just just felt like uh, the, the trainers were too weak, so I was just not prepared at all for this. Even after spending, like, s multiple hours grinding with the Versus Seeker. Because you can't Versus Seeker in Victory Road, and the wild Pokemon there aren't that great for XP. Chansey's not common enough. Yeah, but it's fine. I had fun with it. I had fun with it. I'm not trying to crap on the game because it was hard at the end. I'm just... Yeah, <laughs> I'm trying to choose my words carefully. Anyways. Oh, Super Mario, te uh, Super Mario Club. But we're starting new stuff this week, and I did not want to just, like, spend a few hours on this weekend <laughs> to do another grind session. Anyways. Special thanks, all these people. Are these... Hang on, these are at the actual credits now, right? Yeah, they are. There we go. English version, people. Braille code check. I love how you can't even see the braille at this point. The end. All right. It wouldn't have been that bad if there was a proper way to grind. Yeah, it seems like that's that's a common thing people are saying about this. Hang on. I'm not trying to like bitch. I loved. I like the game. I'm not trying to be like the you know those streamers where they get to the end and they're like, it's stupid. You can't make your game like that. I hate it. I'm not trying to be that guy. Ah, Red, you're back, are ya? There's something I want to ask you. Come follow me. Okay, though. I don't know about Nuzlocke in this one on challenge mode, to be honest. I feel like the Elite Four are just going to wipe you out if you don't have a very specific team at that point. This seems a more appropriate place to talk than outside. Okay. Hey, Grandpa, what are you playing without me? I didn't forget about you, Blue. Getting information for the decks is important. You both have come a long way as trainers. At this point, you shouldn't be confined to the Kanto region. We can't go there, though. So I ask you to explore further. He's given me this, but it won't work. 
all this trouble for this? I'll go ahead since I'm faster, smell ya. Show it to the fairy, sailor, and Vermilion Island. Vermilion Island? You mean Vermilion City? He will take you to the Sevi Islands in no time. Maybe, maybe need a text edit there. A Nuzlocke would seem rough. Yeah. Again, I'm not trying to crap on the game. I like it. I'm just saying, like, I don't know. I, if you watch this stream live or on YouTube, I think you you get what I mean about the difficulty all of, out of nowhere like that. Okay. Now, if I go to him... Sorry, Sevi Islands will be available in future versions of the game. Yep, see? Can't do it. We did it. Let me see here. <laughs> so that's pretty much everything we can do. We can go catch Mewtwo in Cerulean Cave, but there's not really much point in that, I feel. I, streamer did not say game is impossible. I did not. All right. I wanted to play it for a challenge, and I got it. It <laughs> just like uh, a bit too much of a spike at the ends. We got a schedule to keep this week. Anyways, it doesn't matter, chat. I feel like uh, I had fun with it. I just feel like people are going to be mixed on the ending after that. But it's okay. I wanted to start a short little playthrough for the uh, the PNG tuber, and I got to do that. I had a, lot of, had a lot of fun. We got to have a lot of fun talks during this series. And today was a little bit all over the place for me. What, what's the time for this? Just under two hours? Yeah, we can call it here. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up, go make some food, and I'll be back with streaming tomorrow. I hope you guys managed to have a fun time with this. Let me know your thoughts in the game down below. And um, I definitely would come back to this in the future when, when it's updated. But for now, we're going to wrap it up. I hope you all enjoyed this. Hope it was comfy. Hope it was cozy. Have a good night, and bye-bye.